and lovelies welcome back to the fancy dollar for those who are new welcome so today we will be cash dumping 1230 so let's just get started So that is correct for our cash. And first thing first, we're gonna go to our wallet. Do you have a bunch of coins this time? A bunch of coins this time. So yep. Alright. Jar is getting quite filled. And then I have some receipts that I need to scan and fetch. Right now, there's a promotion going on. I think we both get 1,000 points. My referral code is linked down below. If you guys are interested, you basically scan your online receipts and your paper receipts, and you get points to redeem gift cards. So I have a few. I have going out to eat, Dollar Tree, the mall from Kava, Walmart, Postal Office, um, some Louis Vuitton and more post office that I need to scan. So I'm going to put this to the side. And then, so I came to the conclusion that I will not be doing the dollar savings challenge anymore because uh, I don't find it useful. So yeah, so personal is getting another $40. So personal now has 20, 40, 60, 70. I might put it into my personal spending. Um, who knows? And then gas is getting 60. So now it has 20, 40, 60, 80 for the week. I'm debating to make those long envelopes for my wallet. Um, so my mom is actually going to give me her pre-owned um, Chanel wallet because um, she ordered uh, another wallet from Chanel and she said that she doesn't want or she doesn't need the one that she's currently using. So she's going to give me her Chanel wallet. Um, I think she went to like the boutique in New York Chanel to get her new wallet. And for dining out is getting 35 And so now it has 20, 30, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, oh wait, 30, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, so 49, but for now, I am going to stuff, because um, I want to put some in my dining out envelope, so I am going to put 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. So 30 is going to go towards my envelope, I remember. So now in my, in my thing, it's going to be 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Which should be plenty. Because I only go to like get sushi. And um, that sushi place, my parents' friends own it. So he gave me like 50% discount. Um, the miscellaneous is going to get taken out because it's going to put be put into my personal binder. Tips is getting um, 10. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Sometimes the tip is used for when I see someone on a highway and on the streets and um, they're homeless. Um, I give them like a couple dollars. Groceries is getting 40. And entertainment and fun is getting 20 as well. So I think I'm actually going to put some money in my personal spending piece. I don't know if I need all this, but I'm just going to keep in this for now. So that is it for my wallet. And then we're going to jump into our savings challenge. And we're going to stuff $35 this week. And I am having like, not a sale, but I will be selling these for um, $25 including shipment. Um, but it will not have the picky boo style, it's just going to be plain white paper um, in a glossy laminated sheet. So that way you can reuse these because if you put in a laminate, I don't think you could erase it. I'm not sure. But $25 for all 12 months, there's a small amount option which is around $580 at the end of the year you save and the large amount is around $1,800 so do hit me up on Instagram um, so I can create your custom order for you so that is getting $35 I almost forgot to stuff that and the final of August has $5,100, $20, $40, $50, $60, $70, 80 so 180 for August. So like I said, this is going towards bills or um, my student loans. But for now, I'm going to put into um, bills. So I'm going to put this to the side as well. And then for my personal loan payment, we're going to stuff 25. So every two rows is going to be added to its um, payment. And then a student loan, again another 25. So I do have two Happy Mail coming. Um, two of the companies on Instagram reached out to me so you guys will see some happy mail from me probably in two weeks and the next thing we're gonna go to our bills binder which is my new taupe moterm uh, PayPal is getting So this is for the end of the month payment. Um, end of the month payment on the 26th. So basically in a couple of days or in a week. So PayPal now has 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 550, 570, 590, 610, 630, 650, 670, 675, 76, 77, 78, 79. So 679 for PayPal. And that is a complete payment for the the month or the entire statement. All right. So next one will be American Express, and American Express is getting twenty one dollars. So the last cash stuffing it had fifty dollars, and then I added the one eighty five from travel funds because I did book my uh, flight to Orlando for Disney World for November. So it's gonna get twenty one. So now it has 100, 200, 20, 40, 50, 55, 56. So 256. That is getting skewed because I already paid for it because it's upcoming on the 21st and I only spent $60 on here, which is for gas. 
and then my new envelopes that I made. If you guys haven't checked out that video, I did set up these new binders and new um, envelopes, and I do have this on my custom orders on Instagram. Um, and then my Federal Credit Union loan is getting 65 So now my credit union loan has 50, 100, 150, 160, 70, 80, 90, 95. That's okay. 150, 160, 170, 180, 190, 195. Okay, so 195, sorry. Annual fees is getting $15. So now it has 100 in the bank, 200, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 55, 255, and my budget and goal for this is 345 because my Amex annual fee credit card is 250 and my city premier is 95. My Porsche payment is getting 195. And I do need to do a condensing soon because um, some of my envelopes have too many small bills. Portia has now has 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90. 390. I'm actually like two weeks ahead on payment again. Easy Pass Tolls is getting 10, so now it has $30. Vehicle registration is getting five dollars, and I'm thinking about just doing the one year actually because my one year renewal is fifty dollars and two years is a hundred. Um, vehicle registration that has 10, 15, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 5, 6, 7, 8, 28, and vehicle registration and vehicle insurance is getting seventy dollars. See, this needs major condensing, as you can see. So now vehicle registration has 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 600, 20, 40, 60, 80, 700, 20, 40, 60, 80, 800, 20, 40, 60, 80, 880, and vehicle insurance. So $1,000 more um, than I will be paying for that in November for my insurance, which is a 12 month contract, so one year. Auto Cure is getting $10. Now it has a 500 in the bank, 600, 20, 40, 50, 60, 70. 670. I do need to get the car washed soon as well. My car is so dirty. It has, I drive on a highway and I literally smack every single bug that's in the world. Like, I don't understand, like, I hate the bugs. One month ahead, it's getting $20. And now that we're here, I do want to put some money into my one month ahead for my savings challenge. So 100, 20, 40, 50. So 150 going somewhere else, 10, 20, 30. So another $30 in one month ahead. So now it has 20, 30, 40, 50. Monthly subscriptions is getting five dollars. So now it has five, ten, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, one, two, three, four. Twenty-four. Memberships. So this is my gym membership. So I did talk about me moving to another gym because my current gym is actually near my job and the really the only reason why i applied to that one is because when i was working on site every single day monday through friday i would just go straight at the work which is really close and then drive home but now since i work remote i need to find somewhere that's closer to home because right now i'm spending all my gas money just to drive to the gym so you see i 
basically pay like $80 a week or sometimes more to go to the gym so now I'm gonna probably switch over to Lifetime Fitness which is $200 a month but when I say there's a lot of amenities that you can take advantage of like that $200 is actually like cheap I'm not saying it's cheap but if you take advantage of all the amenities like the spa, massage, basketball courts, Pilates, hot yoga, cold yoga, they have an indoor pool. They have two indoor pools, one heated, one cool. Um, they have ten whirlpools. They have an outdoor pool. Like they actually have so much stuff. And there's four floors, so membership is getting fifty dollars. So it now has fifty, sixty, seventy, seventy one, two, three, four, five, seventy five. But I am stuck with my current gym until October 14th because I do have a contract with them and it ends on October 14th. And then the next thing we're going to do is our long term. And our long term medical is getting $20 per usual. And now it has $500, $600 in a bank. 700, 750, 77, 790, 810, 830, 850, 870, 890, 910. 910. So $90 away from $1,000. So can't wait to put a place order for that. Dental is getting $5. So it now it has 100 in the bank 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 170. I do have a dentist appointment for my six month cleaning on September 12th, I think. Gotta double check that. And for a new home, we're stuffing $50. But I have $150 here, so I'm actually gonna stuff another $50 for that. So $100 total is getting, going into here today. So now new home has $20,000, $21,000, $22,000. 100, 200, 300, 400, 500, 22,500. You guys did mention and commented that apartment slash home finder is actually a really good idea, so I think I'm gonna be doing that. Travel fund is getting 100, and um, I think I might put another 50 in here. So 150 is going to travel fund. So travel fund now has 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 6, 10, 6, 15. So 1,000, 6, 15 in travel fund still. Student loan is getting $50 to so the last 50. So now it has a 500 in the bank. One, Oh, 600, 700, 800, 900, 1,000. So this one could get a 1,000 placeholder. Hooray. Wedding is getting skipped. Emergency is getting $5. So now it has 500 a bank, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, and 605. Hubs is getting ten dollars, so probably gonna use this to get his um probably gonna use this spending for um, Disney World. So anything he wants at um, Disney Spring Shopping Center. So now he has 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 100, 110, which is plenty. We still have like a couple months to save up for that, and then that is it for this binder. Now we're going to go to um, my business and necessity binders, I guess. Organizing is getting $5. So now it's $15. Stationery is getting 5 So now it has 10 15 20 25 YouTube is getting $5, and that is all it has. Shipping is getting 7 Um, But, 
I am going to add that miscellaneous 5 from my wallet as well as a 20 from the savings because I do have to ship out um, about 9 orders because I did, did that bundle on Instagram for the binders and the 6 envelopes that comes with it. So now shipping has 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. $35. Hopefully that's sufficient enough. Supplies is getting 5 and now it has 15. Equipment um, isn't getting anything. That is, isn't getting anything. Pet care is getting $5. Oh my god. Talking about our pets. Emmy, my German Shepherd, she, for some reason she's scared of the blender and uh, his mom used a blender that one morning and when we let her out to like use the restroom, well I didn't let her out, his brother let her out and she literally ran into a forest. Our backyard is like a big forest, if you run too far in it's like literally 10 acres of forest and she got lost and thank god um, animal controlled um, in New Jersey helped us find her because my boyfriend was in tears he was literally looking for her for like two three hours like she was like no in sight of like we literally could not find her and I was getting really worried because it was about to get dark but thank god animal control of New Jersey helped us and thank you for <laughs> New Jersey animal control because without them I think that like we wouldn't be able to find her but we did buy an air tag for both our dogs I don't know why we haven't thought about it in the first place, but yeah, that that was really scary. Now pet care has 20, 30, 40, 45, 46, 47, 48. Sorry about the ramble about my dogs, but yeah. Parents is getting five, and it has five in there already, so 10. Birthdays is getting 20. And then holidays is getting... 20 as well so now holidays have 100 200 300 400 450 470 490 510 530 540 545 546 546 in holidays all right so last but not least is my personal binder so that's gonna go here So personal spending is getting ten dollars and this is for dining out. So personal spending is also getting another twenty from the savings challenge. So now it has twenty, thirty, thirty one, two, thirty four, five, six, seven, eight, thirty eight. So dining out is getting 10 from the budget budgeting and then the rest from the rollover from my wallet. So now actually I'm gonna actually trade in some ones. One, two, three, four, five, four. So now dining out has 20, 30, 40, 30, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 45. And then date night is getting 10. Fun is getting 10 as well. Supplements is getting $5. And I do have to bulk up or buy another bottle of digestive enzymes. So now it's 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 27. And then beauty is getting 15. Now that I think about it, I do need a. So my refill went up, and I have a refill next week. And after tip and stuff is 120. So I'm actually gonna take 20 from personal spending and 20 from dining out because I already have money in my. 
um, wallet so they don't need that so beauty is gonna get 20 40 50 55 56 57 okay perfect sorry I'm like all over the place and I just want to make sure that I'm budgeting correctly for what I need because I don't really need to like spend on anything right now or like dining out because usually when we go out my boyfriend usually pay for everything so yeah and then last is last is jewelry and it's getting the last two pies which is 10 so cute all right so that is it for this week's cash topping and i hope you guys enjoyed it and if you guys did please like comment subscribe and i'll see you guys next week bye